All right, this was brought to us by Oz here. And this looks like a mobile game. Now, Oz was saying on this particular title that he wishes it was for other than mobile. Sometimes, like, I can dig a good mobile game when I'm on the go. Uh, like, if I'm just, like, in the car or something and I can't get to my games, if I can't get to the house and I can't play on a PC like everybody should. Uh, you know, sometimes if you pop on a good mobile game, you're in your car, you're eating lunch. Maybe you got some Chipotle in the car. Maybe you want to just game a little bit on your lunch break. Uh, you know, we're going back to work now. You know, pandemic's over, right? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right. Mom just got COVID. Pandemic's over. Pandemic's over, right? Uh, let's check it out. Let's see. It's called Warpath here. I'm not quite sure what it's about. Uh, and it looks like it's for mobile. Oh, World War II. We're talking World War II? Oh, I love my World War One and World War II games. Wow. Explosion. Calling it. First off, first off, let me just say this. It will never be like this good with this good graphics on mobile. So it's probably some type of like um, RTS or, or strategy tactical game, which is fine. I'm down with that. You know, like you usually get these really awesome cinematics for, for mobile games and then you play the mobile and obviously it's not going to. I just want to say that. Right. It's a trailer. Exactly. Evil. What's up, evil? Welcome to the stream, bro. Good to see you, man. But like I I always hearken back to the days of board games when I played Axis and Allies with my dad, man. And and I'll tell you what, man, that was a really enjoyable board game, dude. That was a very tactile, like it was it, it had a real good tactical feel on it. And uh, Axis and Allies, like as a board game, was the shit. And if there's any game, even if it's a mobile game, they can kind of give me the vibes of like the Axis and Allies or like an RTS kind of uh, game. Uh, I might be down for that, you know? Did you, sweet red? We got good taste, bro. You better watch out, dude. That dude. They went the German route. <laughs> okay, okay. Props to the to the guys doing the cinematography on this, though. <laughs> Like, like, I have to say, I'm digging the feels of like the actual, <laughs> like the, the trailer itself. Yeah. Right, right, evil, right. Are you getting some uh, CNC vibes off this too? You guys getting some Command and Conquer vibes off of this as well, dude? Like I'm totally feeling that as well. Like I ho I hope it's some type of version of like, uh, you know, <laughs> like I I'm just feeling I'm feeling that way, man. The trailer's actually really good. I I just know that like I feel like I'm gonna be disappointed when I play the game. I hope not. I hope not. Hopefully they got some gameplay. Like gameplay would be nice.
promising a lot on this trailer. They are promising a lot on this trailer, dude. You remember uh, Secret Weapons of the Luftwaffe, man? You guys remember old school uh, Secret Weapons of the Luftwaffe, man? Man, I need to hop back into that and play that, man. Oh, man. Secret Weapons of the Luftwaffe. You kidding me, dude? Every day, man. B-16 bomber uh, gunner turrets all day long song, man. Please. I play that game religiously, dude. Played that game religiously. Like, that's exactly what I felt like when I was watching this part. This this trailer is promising a lot. A lot. Like, I don't know exactly. Like, I hope there is some type of gameplay. Landing was a bitch, and I absolutely love that. I love that you could, like, start your... Like, when your one of your engines went out, I'm, you could shut it down and, like, operate off of, like, three engines or two engines on the bomber, you know? Like, I remember, like, having to, like be able to to fly over and and fly back and and land and like it was such a good game man secret weapons of the luftwaffe I mean, if you ask me, it was pretty easy on that Nazi commander there. All you had to worry about was shaving. You know, if you ask me, like, the, the hardest part of, of war for that commander was shaving. And he and we saw he had a shaving incident. Um, you know, that was not as big a deal as, like, some of these other the soldiers in battle. You know, like, he, he had a shaving incident. He, he, he accidentally cut his cheek. That was his war wound. He did receive a Purple Heart for that. He did receive a Purple Heart for the shaving incident. Um, unfortunately, many others uh, died uh, or, or got injured in battle and did not receive that uh, that medal. So, you know. Thank you, Anarchy. We love you, bro. I mean, like, I feel like this trailer is so fucking epic. Can I just say, like, this is going to be an interesting video when I put this onto YouTube. This trailer, I feel like I've I've played the move. I feel like I've played it. I feel like I've played the game. Like, I'm so attached to this trailer right now. Oz, thank you for putting this in here. If not only just to watch the trailer for this game. Like, I am so happy because I was debating. Oz put this in there and he put it in the Discord and he's like, hey, DG, check this out. It's mobile. And I was like, ah, Blech. I'm like, OK, but I'll give it a shot. And I'm glad I did, Oz. I'm glad I I'm glad I took your advice, dude, because like just watching this trailer is worth it. <laughs> just watching the trailer is worth it, dude. It's got the right amount of blood for me. <laughs> yeah, right here. Yeah! Oh, double death. Look into each other's eyes. Look into each other's eyes, yes. Oh, I saw that. I saw this. I saw this when two people clash together. Mother Russia approves. The Russia approves of this death. Let's watch it again. Can we watch it again? Let's watch this again. Let's watch this again. <laughs> ah, yes. Yes. Look into the eyes of your person that killed you. Both of you killed each other. Yes, I see this. I see this. Yes, I... I see this too. This is good. This is the way life should be. Yes. Yes, this is good. Da, this is good. Da, this is the way. <laughs> okay, bravo. Bravo. I mean, like, really, I don't even give a fuck what the game is at this point, dude. Like, bravo. Like, I, I'm just, I, I could, uh, standing ovation, everybody. <laughs> standing ovation on the trail. 
Congratulations for making a very good trailer. I'm not quite sure what the game is, Warpath, but you've really hooked me in. I feel like I've watched a movie. I feel like I've experienced World War II in its entirety. I feel like uh, I have signed up. I have shipped over. Uh, and I was fighting in that battle, uh, obviously, for Mother Russia. Mother Russia. And uh, I, I will say that was uh, fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Wow, look at that. <laughs> look at that ending. Jesus, that is one way to make a point. <laughs> That is one way to make a point, man. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Have no fucking idea what the gameplay's about. By the way, if you're a game publisher, game dev, and you 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 really want to make a professional uh, trailer, put some goddamn gameplay in it, please. I think the gaming community is tired of of the cinematics without the gameplay. Just Put a couple seconds of it in there so we can at least get a taste. You know? I think that's what the gaming community demands. That's what we want. And now back to the show. If you're not here live on stream with us, you're missing out. Get your ass over here on the stream live.